Hi everyone, welcome, welcome to our next tutorial. This tutorial here, we've got a DC battery, which if we follow conventional current flow, will allow current to flow in this direction here. Now, this is a parallel circuit. In other words, when the current flows, out this direction current can go down this path or it can go down this path here now very important to remember that in a parallel circuit which we have here the electrons can go in either branch but what we might, must remember is that electrons travel through the path of least resistance. In this case here, there's no resistor down this path right here. Down this one, there is a resistor. So this circuit, the current will flow through this branch, but not through this branch. As a result, there is no resistance in this part of the circuit this is what we call a short circuit and it will short our battery. Our battery will get very warm or hot and potentially permanently damage the battery. So very important then when we hook up circuits we always look to see that potentially if there is a short circuit we want to avoid that situation. So there's one example of a short circuit Watch out for that when you're building your circuits in class. Take care. We'll talk to you soon.